Today, I would like to introduce to you Dr. John Tyus. Dr. Tyus has created an avenue for helping out fatherless males. Welcome to the show, Dr. Tyus. Thank you so much, Larry, for having me. Honored to be here. So good to have you again on the show with us. And, you know, you have this uh, movement you've created called the ID movement. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, so the ID movement, uh, the I stands for inspire and the D stands for develop, because what we're trying to do is really inspire and develop young fatherless males and trying to develop them into the men that they're supposed to be, impactful men in their community. And why do you think we need to help fatherless males? What kind of brought you to this uh, particular area? Well, what brought me to this area was really my own personal experience. My father passed when I was eight years old from colon cancer. So I personally know how it feels to grow up without that uh, mentor in your life. So I definitely didn't want any other male to experience what I experienced. So it was really my pain that uh, produced my passion and my passion that brought me to my purpose. Well, I am so uh, happy that you found this purpose because there's many young males and even older males that could use your help. And you have a book out, John, that you've been uh, actually bringing to the Cleveland area. So let us know about uh, your book, what it's about and how people can get it. Yeah, the title of the book is The ID Movement Presents Voices of the Sons, Letters from the Emerging Leaders. So we have a compilation of all um, impactful leaders that are stepping up to the plate and becoming the leaders of today. And they're writing letters to their generation and the generation that's coming up behind them. So uh, I think it's very impactful. It's needed uh, for us to not only mentor physically, but mentor from a reading perspective as well. Well, I love that. What uh, inspiration before we go would you give to all the fatherless men out there? Um, that there's hope. There's hope, uh, you know, that uh, allow this pain, like I stated earlier, to become your passion and allow that passion to drive you to your purpose because the pain is not over. Um, the pain is, doesn't stop at pain. Um, the pain is the beginning. But if you can make it through the pain, you'll reach your purpose. Well, thank you so much, Dr. Tyus. How can someone contact you if they'd love to get your book or even uh, find out about uh, getting a speaking engagement with you? Yeah, so I'm, I'm on all different social media apps and platforms, rather, at Dr. John Tyus. They can reach me on my email at drjohntyus at gmail or go to amazon.com and type in my name, Dr. John Tyus, and you can see all of the books we've published. Well, thank you so much, John, for being on the show and all that you've been doing. Uh, for, for, for fatherless men in our community. You're truly an everyday champion. I appreciate it. Thank you so much for having me. And I also want to thank you, the everyday champion viewer, for tuning in. But before I go, I always like to leave you an encouraging message. You know, in these days and times, we need to be bold and as confident as a lion. You know, the truth is, we don't have to live under the burden of fear or even anxiety. This is the time where I believe that you should stand tall. And this is the time to believe in the old saying that the only thing to fear is fear itself. You know, think of, think of the way that a lion roars in the jungle. He or she doesn't uh, hang, hang their head low or, 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 or do anything that seems like they have fear. The lion hangs their head very high. And so I want you to do that today. I want you to hang your head high and be inspired that you should walk with boldness and walk with confidence. Be confident, be bold, don't give up hope, and let the lion inside you roar like never before. Well, that's my encouraging word for you this week, and I'm so glad that you tuned in to see who's doing some great things in our community. Know that you can visit my website anytime at LarryMakingJr.com or at me on Facebook and Instagram as I post daily inspiration to help you throughout your week. I also speak weekly, and you can find out where by going to mzov.org. But I'm on the lookout for everyday champions who are doing great things in our community. So make sure you contact me and let me know who you think should be on next week's segment. I want to tell you this. You're watching It's About You, and I want you to stay with us.